Oh, hey guys, I'm just walking in from my jolly old weight loss grocery haul, ready for this. Ta-da! Whoa, that's pretty cool. We did it, yes! The friends, this is the mother load weight loss grocery haul. We have the plethora of groceries you will ever see and some new stuff for the week that I'm really excited about. So let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> This is a new discovery. Thanks to Will Tennyson. Yes, thank you, Will Tennyson. We learned that this is a low calorie bread. Villaggio Artisano? I don't know how you say Come that. Come on, you're Italian. <laughs> Artisano. There we go. Two slices is 150 calories. And the thins that we eat, two slices is 140. So this is great. And this bread is way thicker. And it feels like you're eating like really good fancy bread. So, Once you go artisano, you never go backo. <laughs> you read my mind. Okay, we have two of those. And this is like the greatest grocery haul ever because Walmart had this, which we haven't seen in months. They're actually bringing Diet Pop back to the grocery stores. Wow. What? It's an alternate universe. This is the Toasted Vanilla Diet Coke Extra. This stuff is amazing. If you haven't tried it, you gotta get it. We also have a Coke Zero and a Pepsi. It used to be called Pepsi Max, right? It's hey, I still called it Pepsi Max today at the store. It's Pepsi Zero now. Yeah, isn't that weird? But anyway, do you guys remember when it was called Pepsi Max? It's like a 1984 conspiracy theory where they just change names and then when people like us bring it up, everyone's like, no, that it was always called Pepsi Zero. Okay, tell us in the comments down below if it was Pepsi Max or if we're just crazy. We might be okay. losing it. That might be also true. I I swear that it was Pepsi Well, don't Max. swear because it's PG on this channel. Oh, it, that's true. Yeah. Okay, I baloney that this was Pepsi Max. Okay. <laughs> we also got our favorite popcorn. Two boxes of the Smart Pop. It's 94% fat free. Will Tennyson didn't actually buy us this bread. He just kind of let us know about it on his YouTube channel. <laughs> it's not like he sent us the bread, but he should be sending us bread, but that's Yeah, fine. that would be pretty awesome. Will Tennyson, send us bread. We know he works at Artisano. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, we got three pizza sauce. The hot and spicy pizza squeeze is our favorite. Why is this a pizza squeeze? Because you can't call it sauce. <laughs> Cause it's not, it's a squeeze. <laughs> it's hot and saucy squeeze, okay? And we have a dozen eggs, the large ones. No, there's 12 it says. I knew he was gonna do something. See, it's not a dozen. Hank. Guys, let her know, it's 12, <laughs> okay? Get it right. Don't listen to the sass behind the camera. Okay, we have the kernel seasoning. The We were getting low on these ones, the all dressed, the ketchup, and the cheddar. And actually, even though he's sassy, he is a genius when it comes to kernel seasoning. He came up with combinations with these. If you mix the cheddar and the all dress, he calls it party mix. It is amazing. I love this one. And then he came up with this combo, which is my second favorite. It's the ketchup and can, he calls it the KD, like the Kraft dinner. Cause in Canada we eat ketchup, not me, but him. I do. On our mac and cheese. And so this, delicious. Then. I'm actually getting credit today. Did I do something? We, special? You made up those great seasonings. Huh. Then you were sassy after. So you can have sass and frass. Yeah. We have, we love making low calorie ice cream with frozen fruit and um, we get some toppings for it, some low calorie toppings. So these are currently our favorite. So we got the thin crisps. These are amazing and one package is 100 calories. And there's a reason why we didn't go with like the Oreo version, right? These things, these are lower calorie. These or? are lower in calorie. The Oreo ones, you only get two Oreos for, I think, much higher calories than this and a little more fat. Whereas you can eat a whole pack of this. For a hundred, right? For a hundred and only three grams of fat. So it makes more sense to get these. And they have two kinds in Canada. Um, the chocolate, which are amazing. They taste kind of like Oreos without the cream. And then these chocolate chip ones. And it was funny at Walmart, I was sad because I couldn't find these. And 
something told me look lower and at the very back there was one left it was like waiting for me synchronicity miracles yeah. put your mind to it put your back into it all right no we're pg we're pg here okay? i'm not showing that <laughs> edit it out these are really good they come in a ton of flavors cookies and cream and blueberry but we got the strawberry today and oh yeah we also put these on our ice cream we crumble them up this is the fiber one bars we have chocolate chip cookie and fudge brownie these are our favorite and they they go really good with fruit these are the best protein bars. They're the lowest calorie that we can find. Hashtag in. not sponsored by anybody. We're not sponsored by any of these things, but we should be. No one will pay us anything. Tell them. Go tell <laughs> Pure Protein. Hello. <laughs> I don't know why no one wants to pay me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we were we have every flavor literally you can get that's lower calorie but we were running low on these so the red velvet and the birthday cake yeah they do have lots more flavors than the ones you guys have shown or we've shown you guys but we get the ones we get because of the calorie count yeah there's quite a few other ones but they're higher in fat and calories and we like to stay under 200 calories per bar and under fat well five grams of fat and under per bar so we've got some romaine because we're going to be eating a different lunch this week. Three bags of the romaine hearts. We've got two of these mushrooms already sliced. Already sliced saves us so much time. This stuff is going on our lunch wraps this week. This is the calorie wise Greek feta and oregano. I'm sliced all year, baby. <laughs> 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 I'll uh I'll CGI on some abs later for you in post. Dude, shh, shh. they can see it. There's side ones coming, but I'll I'll CGI in some abs later. They pretended their uh, their abs are there. Yeah. Right, guys. Two of these fat-free cheese slices. Some tomatoes. On the vine. I was just gonna joke about that. You know when you do the self checkout at Walmart and it says weigh your tomatoes on the vine. Place your tomatoes on the vine in the bag. <laughs> that is really funny. Small things amuse small minds. Friends. Is that not funny to anyone else? No. The, the Walmart scanning voice? No. Peppers. <laughs> the, we like the rainbow ones because it sort of changes everything up when you have three different types. So orange, yellow, and a red. And like I said, we use the fruit. There's two red peppers and one orange. Is that not orange? Oh my gosh. Well, it could, I don't know. I don't know. Guys, but is this red or orange? We're losing it. <laughs> it's late at night, okay? <laughs> okay, we eat a lot of frozen fruit in our low-calorie ice cream. So we have one mixed berry. We have two, two blueberry. Bloobs. And then we have also two of the sliced strawberry. The other ones are down there. We've got a box of these lean chicken burgers. These are so tasty and really low calorie and fat for a burger. We got a big spinach, the baby spinach. That was kind of like a baby goat. Actually. Yeah, I was just gonna say it sounded, isn't there a name for baby goats? Kids. Joey's. No, that's okay. No, it's a Joey for a baby no, goat. No, it's not. Yeah. A goat is a kid. What? Yes, a baby goat is a kid. No, they're babies, Guys, not kids. Tell Sass. A, a baby, baby goat, goat is, is a, a joey. No, it's a kid. A baby kangaroo no. is a joey. No. Yes. Yes. They will tell A baby you. goat is a baby, not a kid. If it was a kid, it'd be called a kid goat. You know how many comments we're going to get saying, Sass, you're up your <laughs> 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 I think they're called uh, toddlers. Baby goats. Guys. Tell him who's right, okay? Jones. Nicole is right. Sass, you're get, up the... Get out of here. You know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Pineapple tidbits. Two cans. I'll give you a little tidbit of information. We bought two cans. Guys, <laughs> he does that every time. Seriously. And I'm so excited for these. I was craving them and I wasn't going to get them because it adds fat in my diet. But I was like, you know what, Nicole, life is short. Get the olives. I'm going to measure them out. Have five, whatever, on my sa a salad wrap. It's going to be amazing. You know what I was looking for and I was pretty upset? The unripe 
olives. I was wondering what kind of dad joke you were gonna pull from that. I'm pretty impressed with that. Pretty actually. good one. Pretty good. Not bad. Look I'm at this. pretty impressed you can catch. <laughs> you see this? I put up with this all day, every day, 24 hours a day. Sass all day. That's why you have to tell them. 60% of the time you put up with it all the time. Guys, this is a red onion. <laughs> then we have three cucumbers. We've got four egg whites. And the Walmart guy in the egg section was amazing. We don't, there was only one and I had a feeling to ask him for more and he literally went through the entire store dug out a box for us and came back. Yeah. It took him a really long time. He literally went the extra mile He for really us. did and we really appreciate it. So thank you Walmart man, I don't know your name, for the egg whites. Four cartons of fat-free plain Greek yogurt. I think someone was saying watch the plain fat-free ones. No, they were saying watch the fat-free ones because um, they might have more sugar. Yeah. You just have to check the label because this is pretty decent sugar on this one. It's four grams for three quarters of a cup. That's really good sugar. Anything higher than that is a bit too high. We have four 1% cottage cheese and we got some coffee. And I don't know that we've ever had this before. The, no. uh, and actually, hey, watching Will Tennyson's latest video, I think it was his video where he did leg day with Fuad. He's got uh, Tim Horton's dark and I'm like, oh, we'll try the dark Van Hoot. I don't think we've had that No, before. you know how in Canada the new label is usually on for like years? <laughs> yeah. Well, I think this is actually new. No, it's not new. I, it's new. House Blend Dark, that's cool. The Joey's are new, but the dark coffee's Hank. not. <laughs> I still talk to she my dog. She still tells on me to our <laughs> not alive <laughs> dog anymore. So I don't think you can say the D word on oh, YouTube. Oh, sorry. Uh, Hank, even though you're sleeping in heaven. <laughs> uh, baby dill pickles, these are so good on pizza. Guys, pizza, Pickles on pizza, yes or no? Those in uh, America are called kid dills. Oh my gosh. You dropped the artisan. <laughs> no, it fell because- The Villaggio. It fell because it was telling you to stop your sassy. <laughs> the kid dills. I don't, we call these banana peppers, but the jar says pickled what hot pepper they? rings. <laughs> what Guys, are these things? We're, we're losing it. We buy things at the grocery store that we don't know what <laughs> Will you are. tell us, are these banana peppers or are they only pickled hot pepper rings? And if you know the difference between banana and pickled hot pepper rings, then tell us, please. Yeah, please, help us because out. Because we won't be able to sleep tonight until you tell us. <laughs> Except we have to sleep before this video goes out. And then we have leg day after this and it's already late. It's fine. We're, it's fine. We don't know what we're doing. We'll take pre-workout at midnight and be up all night. Baby fine. goats are kids. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> we have smooth peanut butter. Do you remember the friends that we used to only love crunchy? Now we're on team smooth for a while because we needed to change. But and that one is actually not fully smooth. It's no, like medium smooth. Yeah, it's got like little crunchy bits in it. It's like if I haven't shaved in a few days. <laughs> like that kind of. It's crunchy bit? Yeah, <laughs> crunchy. <laughs> Okay, and so we saved the best for last. We're getting delirious. <laughs> Help us, friends. This train is going off the tracks pretty fast. We got lots of uh, processed meat, so I'm sure you'll yell at us well, in the comments. Well, they already yelled at us for the diet pop, so they oh, already, that's those true. people already left. Oh, that's true. <laughs> they would have yelled at us for all So the... if you stayed past the diet pop, you're probably, you don't care about the lunch meat. But if you do care, you're free to yell down below. I'm going to eat it anyway. Uh, chicken breast, we have the club size pack of that. Then we have some cooked and seasoned turkey breast. There's, for two slices, there's no, barely any fat in 30 calories. Yeah, look at that fat. And then we've got three slices of ham here. Well, this is not three slices, but it's the ham, and it's the black forest ham that tends to be really lean. This is 50 calories, one gram of fat for three slices. Pretty good, guys. So, the friends, that is it. This is how I'm getting lean, but not mean and spilt. Looking forward to my food, eating lots of low calorie deliciousness, that's a lawnmower trick. <laughs> My, it's time to stop to the to video. Bed. Yeah. <laughs> um, Kyle and I have lost 130 pounds and each and kept it off for over five years. If you want the easy way of how we did it, 
We have two weight loss guides. Links are down below. Exactly what we ate to lose our first and next 50 pounds. Check them out. Watch these two videos and do this chicken. Whoa. Yeah, look at my shoes. Leg day shoes, guys. On point. Yep. And thanks for mailing us the bread, Will. Yeah, thanks, Will, for the bread. <laughs> Peace out, guys. Whoa, that's a serious face right there. <laughs> we gotta stop, things are coming out of my mouth now. Uh, no comment. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it, you can do it. Don't give up.